Break a leg. Good luck. Break a leg on your audition tomorrow. Hit the nail on the head. To be correct or accurate. You really hit the nail on the head with your analysis. A piece of cake. Very easy. That test was a piece of cake. Once in a blue moon. Rarely. I only see my old friend once in a blue moon. Cut to the chase. Get to the point. Can we cut to the chase and talk about the main issue? Break the ice. To initiate conversation or interaction. I tried to break the ice with my new colleagues by asking about their weekend plans. Pull someone's leg. Tease or joke with someone. I was just pulling your leg about the new job opportunity. Kick the bucket. To die. I'm afraid my old dog finally kicked the bucket. A dime a dozen. Very common or easy to find. Those knockoff designer bags are a dime a dozen. Under the weather. Feeling sick or unwell. I think I'm coming down with something. I feel a bit under the weather. Catch someone's eye. Get someone's attention. The colorful display in the store window really caught my eye. Bite the bullet. To face a difficult situation with courage. I know it's tough, but you just need to bite the bullet and have that difficult conversation. Burn the midnight oil. To work or study late into the night. I had to burn the midnight oil to finish my term paper on time. Cry over spilt milk. To be upset over something that can't be changed. I know you made a mistake, but there's no use crying over spilt milk. Piece of work. A difficult or complicated person. My boss is really a piece of work. It's hard to know what he wants sometimes. Kill two birds with one stone. To accomplish two tasks at once. By going to the gym during my lunch break, I can kill two birds with one stone and get my workout done while also taking a break from work. Make a long story short. To summarize something briefly. To make a long story short, I got lost on the way to the meeting and arrived late. Drop the ball. To make a mistake or fail to complete a task. I'm sorry I dropped the ball on that project. I'll make it up to you. A penny for your thoughts. Asking someone what they're thinking about. You've been quiet all morning. A penny for your thoughts? Hit the ground running. To start something quickly and effectively. With my previous experience, I was able to hit the ground running at my new job. Leave no stone unturned. To thoroughly investigate or search for something. We need to leave no stone unturned in our search for the missing document. Let the cat out of the bag. To reveal a secret. I accidentally let the cat out of the bag about the surprise party. On thin ice. In a risky or uncertain situation. You're on thin ice with the boss after that mistake. Out of the blue. Unexpectedly. The job offer came out of the blue. I wasn't even actively looking for a new position. Pull one's weight. To contribute one's fair share of work or effort. Everyone on the team needs to pull their weight to meet the deadline. Saved by the bell. 
To be rescued from a difficult or embarrassing situation by an external event. I was saved by the bell when my phone rang during an awkward conversation. The ball is in your court. It's your turn to take action. I've given you all the information you need. Now the ball is in your court to make a decision. Throw in the towel. To give up or quit. After months of trying, I finally threw in the towel and admitted defeat. Actions speak louder than words. What someone does is more important than what they say they will do. Don't just tell me you'll help. Show me actions speak louder than words. All ears. Listening attentively. Go ahead. I'm all ears. Tell me what happened. Ballpark figure. An approximate estimate. I don't have an exact number, but I can give you a ballpark figure. Barking up the wrong tree. To pursue a wrong or mistaken course of action. If you think I'm the one who took your keys, you're barking up the wrong tree. Beat around the bush. To avoid the main topic or issue. Stop beating around the bush and just tell me what you want. Best of both worlds. To have the benefits of two different options. Living in the city gives me the best of both worlds: the excitement of urban life and the convenience of being close to everything. Birds of a feather flock together. People who are similar often gather together. It's no surprise that she and her roommate get along so well. Birds of a feather flock together. By the skin of one's teeth. To barely succeed, I passed the exam by the skin of my teeth. I got just enough points to pass. Close, but no cigar. To almost succeed, but fall short. I was so close to winning the race, but in the end, it was close, but no cigar. Don't count your chickens before they hatch. Don't assume success before it happens. You haven't even been offered the job yet. Don't count your chickens before they hatch. The early bird catches the worm. To be successful, it's important to start early. I always arrive at the office early. The early bird catches the worm. Every cloud has a silver lining. Even in difficult situations, there's something positive to be found. I may have lost my job, but every cloud has a silver lining. It gives me the opportunity to explore other career paths. Fish out of water. To feel uncomfortable or out of place. At the fancy gala, I felt like a fish out of water. I'm more comfortable in casual settings. Get cold feet. To become nervous or unsure about something. I was planning on proposing, but at the last minute, I got cold feet and decided to wait. Get the ball rolling. To initiate something. Let's get the ball rolling on planning the company retreat. In the same boa. In the same situation, we're all in the same boat with this new project deadline. Keep your chin up. To stay optimistic, I know things are tough, but keep your chin up. Things will get better. Kill time. To pass time while waiting. I brought a book to kill time while waiting for my appointment. Let sleeping dogs lie. To not bring up a potentially sensitive issue. I know he made a mistake, but let's just let sleeping dogs lie and move on. 
Make ends meet. To have enough money to cover one's expenses. It's a struggle, but I manage to make ends meet with my part-time job. On the same page. To have a shared understanding or agreement. I'm glad we're on the same page about the project goals. Piece of cake. Something that is easy to accomplish. After studying for weeks, the exam was a piece of cake.